just made it into Starbucks. I ordered a matcha. I'm a drinking in the morning on my way to work. I'm not sure if I'm gonna walk to work or take the Uber, but at least I'll have something to drink on my way to work. Which and look how they spelled my name. Shara. So yeah, because I gotta do what I gotta do, y'all. Your girl ain't got no car, okay? So I'ma pray that this doesn't fall over or empty, spill out. How do people film with one hand? Okay. Let me try. The struggle. Okay. Here's my matcha. Let me, let me save this for in the morning. Put it in. I'm gonna cook the fish tonight. So FYI, I always freeze vegetables because I find it to be cost efficient and I save a lot of money. Okay, so instead of me saying, oh, I need bell peppers, onions. Okay, I have it all in my freezer freezed up so whenever I make a meal I just pull it out chop it up and throw it into that meal that I'm making for the night or for the week and so I need to get some crates to as a matter of fact let me organize this a little bit because all over the place Speaking of lunch bags, let me show y'all something. I have two lunch bags. I mean, I feel like you cannot go wrong with two lunch bags. So let me show y'all my, look at me with this filming, filming complications. Okay, so I don't know if I showed y'all this, but I purchased this lunch pail, lunch bag from the Dollar Tree. I love it because it's a cute, cotton candy, light pink, well insulated. And one day I was leaving work, right? And I had some popsicles in the freezer at work and it was kind of warm outside, anywho. So I put the popsicles in here and the popsicles stayed frozen up until I got home. So I took the popsicles out, put them in my freezer. So this is actually a good lunch bag from the Dollar Tree. And I'll, I always like picking up little things, you know, from the Dollar Tree, especially if it's for a dollar twenty-five instead of paying twenty dollars for a lunch pail. Anywho, so yeah, I thought I'd show that. Oh yeah, I need to soak my rice. So let me get this. So 
anywho, this is how I soak my rice. I put it in a bowl or whatever bowl of your choice. Um, I add my water, then I add some lemon juice, lemon lime juice to be exact. Yeah, lemon lime juice, let it sit for 20, 30 minutes. After that, put the rice in a strainer and rinse the rice out. Hey, just out and about a little bit tonight. Alo. Never heard of the place before. But I thought this was going to be a gym. The store on another day. I need to hurry up and make it to the other department store. It's a lot of loud copyright music up in here, but today is June. I mean, today is July 1st, so I ordered some Cheesecake Factory nachos, and that's what I'm doing right now. I'm up here picking up the nachos, but I'm going to have to cut this video short because copyright music, and I will talk to y'all later. Because when I go see some fireworks, I plan on not spending any money.
it seems like this coffee maker, it only fills my coffee cup up halfway. Do you have a coffee maker like this? This is a true. Does yours fill up halfway? Y'all let me know in the comment section. And so I have to press the button on the side, the cup button, so it can fill up some more. But I wonder why it only fills up halfway. I need to buy some creamer from the Dollar Tree today and then buy some more brown coffee. Let's see y'all, I have to put tap it twice for it to fill, you know, back up again. The struggles I have. So beautiful people. Your girl is getting ready to go to the Dollar Tree on 4th of July. I did call the Dollar Tree store earlier this morning and they told me that they are going to stay open with normal business hours. So that's why I'm heading to the Dollar Tree so late in the afternoon. Plus, I want to pick, pick up some like toilet tissue, um, some little items that I need, like some more AA batteries, AAA batteries for my LED lights here in this room. And then just get out for the day. And then later, I'll probably go see some fireworks. I'm not sure if I'm going to film or if they're going to have fireworks at the location that I am going to. So I'm hoping, okay? And my bus also comes in like 20 minutes. So that's why I'm like up on here chit-chatting with y'all for a little bit. And it's 4th of July. I really don't have no plans. I mean, my era of celebrating 4th of July was over once I hit my 30s. So, yeah, today is it's pretty much like another day, okay? But I'm going to try to do something, you know. And tonight I do want to fly fry some mustard fried tilapia fish and also make some rice, either Spanish rice um, with a side of vegetables. So I'll figure it out, but I'm a, I'm gonna fry some fish tonight and maybe film, film it. So who knows? Um, I hope to create some more content today for y'all, hopefully. Okay. But I'm gonna get ready to go and I will talk to y'all a little bit later. Okay. I'm getting ready to get off the bus because I'm on my way to the Dollar Tree. Hopefully the store is open. You know, I can't see far or near, but hopefully the store is open. I do see cars in the parking lot. So yeah, so hopefully I can go to the Dollar Tree, go to the grocery store and pick up the camera while I'm in both stores. Well, at one at a time, but yeah. So I'll talk to y'all in a little bit. Now y'all, I'm walking past a fireworks stand. The fireworks right here. And I guess you go around, but there's people here and I, you know how people don't like to be on camera when you're filming. So I gotta respect people privacy, but this is how it looks. And then up here, it just says fireworks. TNT box, but we have these party poppers, but you know, I'm not celebrating. Or nothing. Then they have the 4th of July. Oops. Decorator right there. And they also have some sunflower coffee mugs. Surprise, my Dollar Tree is all stocked up a little bit. This is Blow Pop. And these are the Blow Pop minis. Never tried these before. Look like something to carry to work. You know, for that good morning breath awakening <laughs> to a good, you know, breath mint or something. But yeah, I'm surprised they're stocked in the goodie aisle. And also over here in the cookie aisle. And they got some more of these Tupperware thingy, storage thingies. 
you can put peanuts you can put rice up in here this one is in the white color and then this one is in you know what <clears throat> and the teal I was in the store this tripod fell out of my hand my phone fell out of the tripod the little um sensor piece that goes to this tripod it broke but i don't use it anyway some marshmallows for a dollar 38 so they got it in this pack it's actually the large size i'm thinking about probably getting it and then getting some graham crackers but i want to find the graham crackers like on sale your girl trying to save some money trying to see who's down there singing music but it's so packed y'all and i think they shut down the escalators but i'm not trying to be walking down those freaking stairs so so it is just packed up out here okay i found an escalator that's working this room i know i'm being lazy and i need to walk the stairs but no uh -uh. i'm trying to find the fireworks i'm gonna go down here so this is like a little walk-in parade. They got the Kool-Aid over there. I don't know if you can see it. I wanted to go over there and film it, but I feel kind of awkward because, you know, people are like, oh, you got a camera. Look at you, but vendors over there. It is so, it is so packed up out here. I guess I made it to the right place. I guess this is where they're going to shoot off the fireworks. So I'm just waiting and then I'll turn the camera back on. And my battery is Thank you.